Hello friends, I'm uh, Nathan Daniel and uh, today we'll be doing the explore number 10 which is uh, deployment diagram. So in deployment diagram we have uh, components, okay? We have components and uh, we have nodes. So nodes, uh, components can go into nodes and uh, nodes and uh, uh, artifacts can go into nodes. Okay, that thing called artifacts also uh, and associations. You can uh, join two nodes together. So this is how the output will look like. Uh, let's go into the, this, the model diagram. So uh, this is the model diagram what I have drawn. So uh, so the deployment diagram for library management system. So first what happens is we log in. Okay, so login system it uh, initializes the uh, it uh, initializes the sorry for that initializes the user panel. Uh, initialize the admin panel and register user so there are three types of uh, uh, panels uh, you can do that is user panel admin panel and register user so as you can see the sign in login page happens right so that's where uh, these three things come into play so those, these three artifacts as of now we can't add uh, uh, as of now we can't add com components okay because uh, this star human doesn't support it so we can't add components uh, so let's just go on to that. So we, I, this is one node, okay? So the login system is a node that I have added it over here. Uh, so this node is connected to this node, which is the user panel. This is the second node, node two. So in the second node uh, over here, initializes the, so user panel. So in user, so there are two things, right? User and admin. So user, what happens is initializes checkout or return and initializes the book and logout search. Here what happens is admin panel so if you can add remove you can do you can mess with the books you can you can do whatever you want it's okay so so admin has the power to do all that uh, he manages the fees and all the stuff so that's why every time initialize uh, uh, managing users and initializes fees okay uh, so then that's it so user can only like initialize the book like a request for the book uh, and uh, check out or return something like that and he can only log out so now uh, the checkout system so what happens in the checkout system is so now in these two things checkout and uh, yeah, initialize the books this node is again connected to this uh, so this node checkout system what we do here is uh, it's an artifact of a checkout book so you can take the book with you or you can return it back whenever you want uh, in search books, it's connected with a dependency. Uh, sorry, no, no, no. Uh, no, yeah, dependency uh, logout is connected. Uh, uh, yeah, a dependency uh, association. So search books. So it just searches for the books. Uh, you can search for the books. Uh, logout. So the user logs out after that. Uh, it initializes the login system. So if you add or remove books, right? So from the admin panel, now we go on to the uh, managing the books okay so here you can add remove genre add remove books you can view or remove the user you can uh, manage the fees and all these stuff so uh, that's why this dependency is connected because both are accessing logout or initializing the login system so the both are accessing this 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 thing okay so that's why the dependency i put over here where uh, two people can access it so that's the user panel and admin panel so that's what it is for the uh, deployment diagram for library management system. Thank you for uh, tuning in to experiment number 10, which is the deployment uh, diagram for case tools lab. Thank you.